Hi, I'm Rory from eSpares. If the control knob on your tumble dryer is damaged, isn't clicking, or is generally just doing nothing, the problem is going to be with either the control knob itself, the control knob spacer, or the control module, which sits just behind this fascia. Now, you're going to hope that the problem is with the control knob or with the spacer, because these are a lot cheaper to replace than the control module. Either way, I'm going to show you how to replace all three on this Bosch dryer. Um, but the process will be pretty similar for most makes and models of tumble dryer. The one thing you do need to be sure of though is that you have the right spare parts for your model. For that you'll need your full model number which can be either found on the back of the dryer or on the inside of the door. Safety first, always make sure that your tumble dryer is switched off before you get to work on it. And The first thing I need to do is remove this top panel and so I'll need a Torx head screwdriver to remove the Torx screws from the back. I'm now just going to remove the water container and now I can remove the fascia from the dryer. To do that I can just lift up like that. And now we can see our control module and um, I could work on things up here but I'd actually it's easier if I can lay it on a flat surface. So I'm just going to remove all these wires but first before I do that I'm going to take a picture of all of the wires because I need to make sure that I rewire everything exactly as I found it. Okay, I can now start removing these wires. Now I need to unclip the control module from the fascia. There's several clips around the outside and you just need to remove them like that. If they're a bit tight, uh, you can use a flathead screwdriver to help. I can now put my control module to one side. Try not to touch the printed circuit board because that can be quite easily damaged. And um, now I can take out the old spacer and push the old knob through. Now I just need to do the reverse with the, um, with, with the new parts. I can just put the new control knob in, put the new spacer in. This will only go one way. so. Uh, there you go. And now replace the control module. Again, make sure it's everything's the right way around. And clip back into place. Now I'll just need to put the wires back in the control module and fit everything back together. Okay, to put the fascia back on, you just need to hook it into the top there and click it into place at the bottom. Make sure that you don't pinch any of the wires when you're doing that. Now I just need to put my water container back in and I can then put the top panel back on. And that is how you replace a control knob, a control knob spacer and a control module on a Bosch tumble dryer. All these parts are available on the eSpares website. Thanks for watching.